What's good, YouTube, man? We back with another video, man. In today's video, man, we got Deadpool and Wolverine, man. Uh, today, I got, instead of one, two people reacting, man, we got four people reacting, man. Y'all usually see bands, man, but today, we didn't add it, man. My boy E, my boy Jared, man. We about to react to both trailers and give y'all our theories and ideas, man. So, I'm a, I want to start real quick. Bands did have a good point earlier in the, in the first uh, video, so we're going we gonna to talk about one more time about that, too. Uh, basically, what I was saying, because I don't, Jared heard it, but we didn't get your opinion, right? So, and Jared know about, Jared the one who really told me, right? So, Jared, you can see the vid, you can see the, you can see the screen, right? Uh, Jared, you can see the screen, right? Man, Jared, bro, I swear. Selling. All right, boom. Yeah, nigga, I see the screen. All right, listen. You got an so, answer, gang. Boom. You remember, bro, you told me about the Logan game, right? And the first thing that popped up in the Logan trailer was him in a bar, right? Oh, yeah. Boom, right? So you that see... shit that was in the game. Right, so do you think that this is this is a thing that I was really thinking about, too, bro? I was really thinking that this movie was, like, might be the same universe as the game, right? Only reason I say that, because in the Miles Morales movie, right, they had Miles Morales... And remember in the Miles Morales movie, the new one, Into the Spider-Verse, they had the Somniac Spider-Man in there. Remember that? When all the Spider-Man was chasing Miles Morales? Yeah. So do you think this universe right here with him being in a bar could be the Somniac game universe? It depends. Mm, nah, because it's you got to think. A movie and a game are two different shit. You feel me? They, like uh, but it, based it, games they got off movies, good. though. They do, though. I feel like... They do though, E. No, I'm saying though, look, they you know games always had connection to that shit, like right. to movies. So yeah, obviously they connected that with the game. For sure. So they might have little like point of views from the game with the movie. Right. Like you know, put it together type shit. So like if you so now they coming out with a movie, now they go come out with a game. And I So what what if it's like, what if it go off that, like, after that? Like, what if what if the movie at the end, and then when it go to the game, it start off that, just off Wolverine? How how it go off his shit? But his point of view. Mm. That would be crazy. So basically, his point of view yeah, throughout his side of the game. Yeah, his side of the yeah. game of what was happening in this universe. That'd be crazy, right? Now. Yeah, that's a W, bro. That's, a, that's, that's what I'm saying. Good. So it would be two sides of the story. Two sides of the story in the game is showing it'll his be side. His side. It, it, it's Deadpool side, right? But it's with him. That'd be tough. That'd be I'm tough. Saying. Oh, yeah, that'd be that'd be tough. That'd be tough, and I think that's good marketing too for the game. Like starting it, I feel like that's one okay. thing what they did too. They marketed <clears> in the game because soon as this trailer came on, we see Logan, and we seen the Asamia game. We seen Logan sitting at the bar and both. So people who watching the movie, that's gonna make them want to get the game. And then you know the game is coming out what twenty twenty five. Yeah, is it twenty twenty five? Right, and this movie is coming out twenty twenty four. So that's that's good. I feel like that's good marketing right there. That's good marketing. And it's gonna boost the the more people that's gonna buy the game, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I told you. They be knowing what they doing, man. They be doing what they doing. That's good, Mark. Get the fuck out of my bar. Just give me one more drink and then I'll leave. Hi, Peanut. I'm gonna need you to come with me right now. Look, lady, I'm not interested. All right. Well, I'm sort of on the tick tick. So, upsy daisy. Here we go. Oh, whiskey dick of the claws. All right, so, all right, I got a question, right? <laughs> I got, that was crazy. I'm about to hit all that. That was crazy. I got a question, bro. Did y'all hear that, bro? Bro, whiskey D of the claws is crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. That was hilarious, bro, dog. Y'all gotta think about this too, bro. This is about to be on Disney Plus, I believe, bro. Can y'all believe that? Oh, Deadpool is damn. literally breaking the, bro. He literally breaking the rules, bro. Like whiskey D of the claws is crazy, bro. So what do y'all think is going on with this Wolverine? Like, why do y'all think his claws is like not coming out? Like, what do y'all think is really going on? Like, like this is probably the only time we haven't seen his claws come out like not this much. I think in like uh, what was it? No, Logan? that no, happened, it, it before. happened before. He was, it happened before, but it's not he, like this though. He's too drunk, man. Yeah, but it'd I don't think it was like this drunk, though. He's not ready. That's facts. But we we seen it. Was that like, Logan uh, movie? Was that Logan movie? We seen that? Was that Logan? 
I think so, yeah. It happened at Logan. It happened at Logan. And and I think because he was drinking in there too, but he did the same shit. He got into a bar fight one time and he made the bitches come out because he he was drunk then. Right. You feel me? This is an older version of him. He can't really handle it the same way. That's what it is, in my opinion. You think that's fast? <sighs> that's fast. Mm. I See, feel like I with that old age is something doing to him. Bro, I think this like a middle age Wolverine, bro. Like this probably so, like, and like 40s. 40s, no cap. Y'all say 40s? Like, 40s, 50s. This is before probably, this probably just after everything, everything happened type shit. Yeah, yeah. and Logan. Oh. Cause nigga, he was getting his ass whooped and shit. That nigga was fucked up. Look though, his daughter helped. This is because this. Go ahead. Look, I said, look, look, y'all. Let me tell why I'm pinpointing this at right. Boom. I think that so we did see Logan, right? Boom. We seen Logan and we seen this trailer right here. This is my question. Do y'all think Wolverine was older in Logan or older in here? This is my this is my point. I'm trying to I'm trying to pin right. Nah, he was definitely older in Logan. Right, he's older in Logan. Yeah, he had a daughter and shit. So, right, boom, he was older at Logan than he was in this, right? He This did happen. His claws did come out like this, as we can see from the Paul's thing. But remember, it came out, like, two of them came out and one of them didn't come out. Remember, he had to yeah. pull it out. Yeah. So, do y'all think this Logan is getting more drunker due to the simple fact of what's going on? Like, he let his universe down, so he's getting more drunker. So, he, like, at his all-time, like, messed up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He had the lowest. Because that's probably why head. Deadpool there. Because you know Deadpool always uplift the spirits with even with whatever fucking situation you in. That nigga be scrapping the nigga for his life, but he still making jokes and shit. Yeah. But but what I'm hearing though, right, that this isn't going to be the Logan that we see strapped up with his arms off and in the movie. Like, this ain't going to be the main Logan. I think they said that this Logan right here was going to be a Logan from a different universe. Cause he's trying to go to different universes and capture a Logan. He's trying to capture a, a Wolverine. And what it might not be this Wolverine. You see what I'm saying? Oh, he going so basically it's gonna be Deadpool popping in and out of different in universes of different trying universes. to find the right Wolverine. The white Wolverine. And this Wolverine might not be the right Wolverine fit for the job. You can be right about that. That's, I ain't gonna lie. That's, that's, that's tough, too. Like, that's a different scenario than what we was talking about earlier, though. And what was, the, what was that scenario? That the was scenario the... we was talking about. What Ben said. Um, when I was talking about, like, he, it might be uh, the fucking... He let the planet uh, the, get destroyed. The void. Yeah, the well, void. How they gonna yeah. be in the void yeah, and the, shit. The universe, yeah. I think that yeah, that is a that is a yeah. good point too. We gonna we gonna hit on that too. Was with the when that come up, we gonna hit on that, and then we'll be able to pause it and see exactly what's going on. When we actually get to look and examine what's going on. You think of the that. claws? Green's over forty. You don't want this. Unless you over want to take a deep breath through your fucking forehead, I suggest you reconsider. All right, I want to <laughs> go back. I want to go back one more. I want I want to stop it right here real quick. That from what we just seen, right, bro. It's, it's Do y'all so think good. that multiple universes of Wolverine universes went down, like went to disaster, like multiple different ones? Because if this not our Wolverine that's down and going through all that, and the, there's another Wolverine that's going through that, and another Wolverine that's going through that, y'all think all Wolverines, multiverses, man, not multiverses, but universes, like was destroyed and he let down like multiple different universes. And there's only a couple of them that he did, maybe. There could that could I be a possibility. Lie. It could be like slight differences, really, like some real small that it'd be different. Like it won't yeah, even right, be that's, yeah, that's that big of a difference. It ain't even gotta shit. be that the whole thing is down. It could just be that oh somebody passed away, or it could be oh in this one did something else happen, or in this one something else happened. Every universe ain't gotta yeah, be like something like that. Like every like, universe ain't gotta be destroyed and yeah, like some of them, it'll be like nigga during the battle and shit. One of the one of the members died, but the rest of them still here. And then then another universe, it'll be a different nigga, but the rest of them still there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then he'll be taking the Wolverine that he got from a different universe, and he'll be taking them 
two other universes and shit. I don't know if he's like trying to collect this nigga or what, but it would it would be different if he was doing that because then he'll be seeing his fucking friends that died. He know they died, and it's like, damn, I'm seeing these niggas again. This I ain't really supposed to be doing that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Y'all let me tell y'all the theory though before we keep going. Let me tell y'all the theory what somebody said. What do y'all think about this? This is a theory that I have heard that Kane the Conqueror, right? The main villain that was in Loki. I heard that he uh cause cause all right, I was hearing that Wolverine is a key point in the MCU, right? He's like a uh uh like the bone, like the spine of the MCU, right? And mm -hmm. I was hearing it was a theory that was going around on, on uh Twitter saying that uh Wolverine uh is a big key factor on Kang's defeat. So Kang removed or made Wolverine like you know down and like he he caused all that to happen for Wolverine so he could never reach his defeat. Like mutants are mutants are Kang's biggest threat. Hmm. That's what I was hearing. Yeah. And yeah. when I'm saying mutants I'm talking about like like you know Jean Scarlet Grey, Witch. Scarlet we like yeah Scarlet Witch, Jean Grey and Wolverine is a big key point. That's what I was hearing. That's what uh, what y'all think about that theory right there. That that mutants, as in like Scarlet Witch and Jean Grey, some of the most too powerful as Marvel characters, and other characters in the mutant world is is Kane's biggest threat. So he removed the spine out of you know which is Wolverine out of the MCU or out of the multiverse. Mm. That could be a thing because. I mean, like, he wasn't, like, if you really kind of think about it, mm. through Loki and Ant-Man, he really, like, they beat him, mm. but, like, it, it was also, I ain't gonna say lucky, but, like, on some barely type shit, like, right. you feel me? That's facts. Mm -hmm. And, and it, it really oh. could be a different kind of king, too, though, man. It could be a different kind of king. It might not be the things that we see in that video. Because we've seen two already. So right. it could be a third. A it third could one a third could be a little cameo in this. You know what I'm saying? It, it could be. Yeah. It could be a cameo of Kang in here of him stopping the mutants from joining universes with the, with the MCU. I think that, that might be what it be. I don't know. <gasps> All right, so I'm about to lose everything that I've ever cared about. Oh, this is tough. Not my fucking problem. Is that what you said when your world went to shit? So what do y'all think about the costumes? Ooh. What do y'all think about the costumes? What do y'all think about the costumes? That's the original. I, I haven't talked that's about the this. original. I, that's one thing I haven't talked about. What do y'all, how do y'all feel about the costume? Like, if y'all had to rate the them, if y'all had to rate them one through 10, then what do y'all think is missing? What do y'all think is wrong? Like, what do y'all think is, how do y'all feel about the costumes? Only, all, all, well, I'm just saying the only thing that's missing is obviously Wolverine mask. No, yeah, I, I was gonna I never say that. Talked about, sure. I never talked about that. WW point right there. I never talked about that. In the they just that's did something with his hair. They made his hair look like it was like, but I see what they, Wolverine instead yeah, of Yeah, yeah. Like they trying to keep the original look like how he always been though. I see so, what they trying to do. But I got another. I got another. That nigga ain't want to wear that mask. I got another. He ain't want to wear it. I got another. Yeah. y'all. He might do right. wear the mask because. In a in a picture from like a, a while ago, I forgot who it was. I think it was uh Ryan Reynolds, the one who playing Deadpool. I think he posted a picture of Wolverine gloves, them exact gloves and the mask on his Twitter a while ago though. Like it was a while ago. And I think mm. that y'all remember how when Spider Man No Way Home dropped, right? Y'all remember how mm. they was fighting yep. the, the the Sinister Six? Well, they was fighting Sandman and all and and, and Lizard and all them. And they they mm. in that fight they they edit out uh. Uh, the other spy the other two Spider-Mans, remember that? And then we only seen one Spider-Man fighting the whole Sinister Six, but when we watched the movie, it was all three of the spider man swinging through fighting. Y'all remember that? Yeah. So what if this image is just edited out? What if this image is just edited out like the whole time he this throughout the whole movie, when we see him in his suit, he have the mask on. Like we know how iconic the mask is. You see what I'm saying? Like the mask is like yeah. super iconic. It don't, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, why would he have his whole big yellow suit on without the mask? Like, he got the glove. Exactly. I understand if he had no mask and no gloves. He has gloves on too, though. Yeah, would it that, that that'd be legit? No mask and no gloves. Why he fully suited, but he don't got no mask on? What if it's edited out? That 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 I wouldn't even be that surprised by that. No bullshit. 
from like past movies they done came out with, I wouldn't even be that surprised about it because like they did this so many times. They have. But that's a good point right there too, E, because a lot of people was commenting that saying that Marvel is good for editing out of things out their trailer. Then when a the full movie drop, you get to seeing things that you've seen in the trailer, and it's like that wasn't how it looked in the trailer. Hell yeah. Okay. I remember like a bunch of different shit with that. No facts. Cap. Facts. That's facts. That's facts, bro. I think I think it might, it might be edited out, bro. I think he might do got his mask, man. I think it's just edited out. I think that's something that's super duper iconic. Iconic, bro. It's his mask with him fully suited. And I think they want to give us, you know, a cliffhanger in the movie. Bro. So shit. I think that's what that is. All right, so do y'all, do y'all, y'all can see this, right? With Wolverine on his knee right here with the white teeth. Can y'all see this part right here? Yeah. So yeah. I was hearing that these things on the side of him right here is the tombstones of the other mutants or all the mutants that he let down. Damn. Crazy. I was hearing that these tombstones on the side right here. Y'all see him standing and y'all see all the tombstones right here that's, in the grass? I mean, I ain't gonna lie. When I first seen it, that that's what it gotta be. Because, like, why would... Well, he just break down like that. Yeah, like. All right. I, I go like, honestly, I didn't know what these was when I first first seen it. I didn't know exactly what they was until I started yeah. looking up. It, it you kind of really like that's kind of crazy. Like you wouldn't expect these to be tombstones and headstones, and you know what I'm saying. But once um, I start looking into it, I'm like, okay, that gotta be tombstones and headstones of fallen mutants, right? Yeah, gotta be. it gotta be because like, what else would that really? Well, like a line of like a defense or something like. Right. Uh, <laughs> I don't think it would be that. I mean, it could be some magnetic fence type shit in right. the rocks, but like. Hey, before you play this, by this image that you got it paused on, right? No cap. You see how the size is here is flat. Yeah. That's for sure edited, gang, because it looked like he supposed to have a helmet on right now. Yeah, that, that's, like he got helmet here. That's facts. That's facts. Oh, yeah. That's kind of And then of the facts. bottom is curled out like it's something that's on facts. it right now. That's facts. You know when you got hair, bro, when you put that game in headset on, you get to taking that game in headset off, you got a dent. It's like he got a dent yes, all around the circle part, and his hair puffed out at the bottom and puffed out at the top. Yep. Oh, that's facts. That's facts. That's facts, bro. That's fact. And I think that'll make him look more younger. You feel what I'm saying? With the helmet, because you wouldn't get be able to see his face for real. You would just see his beard. You know, you always see his beard going up and his mouth going up to his helmet. Yeah. So that'll make him look more. Yeah, I think that might be legit. This Wolverine let down his entire world. So, right, look, right? Y'all, this is a whole different Wolverine, right? Yep. This is a whole yeah. different Wolverine from the one we just talked about with the with the hair sticking down, right? Because peep the beard. The beard is fully flat. He looks a little yep. bit older, but he has the same outfit on. And the dude, right, in the TVA say this Wolverine, this right? Wolverine. This Wolverine let his planet down. And then if you look at ooh. Y'all can move it too? I think so, yeah. Wait, is that is that y'all moving that right there? Nah, I ain't moving none. Oh. I ain't moving none. What the f Jer? Nigga, I'm not even touching my shit, bro. What are oh. you talking about? I might have accidentally I did it. I ain't gonna lie to you. Uh, this Alright, here we go. He said this will be Alright, so I got another question. What do y'all think is going on? This entire world. With with bro knows. What do y'all think that's happened with bro knows? Y'all see it? It's at 43 seconds. It's yep. playing. It just played. It just played. Yeah, yeah, yeah I it's played it a little bit. Where is that now? Is that Wolverine? Nah. It's no, I'm Deadpool. still seeing Deadpool. All right, let me let me go back. Let me go back. What, what is on now? Wolverine right here? I'm about to lose yeah. everything. Yeah, it's friends. It's friends. Yeah. All right, Deadpool friends. All right, baby. Not my fucking problem. Is that what you said when your world That's was That's a different shit? Wolverine right there, though, y'all. That was laying on the floor. Come again. This Wolverine let down his entire world. Yeah, he was talking to somebody else. Yeah. In the same Are you person. About what's haunting you, or <clears throat> should we wait for a third act flashback? Uh, go fuck yourself. Uh, I think that 
think he got his mask on right here, bro. I think he masked up, bro. I don't know anything about saving worlds. In some movies, he don't be having that motherfucker. But don't. like, I, but it's he. I think about it, that's facts. But he never got the suit though. In no other movies, he never, he got, never the got the never. iconic yeah. suit, bro. He, he never, never has the suit, suit without the hat, without the mask. That is true. Never. The mask that got beat off of him before, but like I ain't never seen him without the mask before that. Literally, bro. The gold guns, though. I know y'all peep the gold guns, bro. Like, come on, bro. That's oh yeah, he did. He demon on that. The gold glove, the gold guns, the gold hey. desert eagles is tough. Yeah, the bro. gold eagles is crazy. Gold tough, eagles bro. is wild. Tough, bro. Trust me, Take a nigga real off. Oh, we got another. We got another theory. We got another theory. We got another theory. Dude. Right? Trust me, kid. I'm no hero. So, right there when he said, "Trust me, kid. I'm no hero," right there was a theory going around that he was either talking to X23, an older version of X23, or he was talking to Kid Pool when he said, "Trust me, kid," because I don't think he talks to Deadpool that calmly and calls him kid. So in that clip where he said. Trust me, kid. I'm no hero. What do y'all? Who do y'all think he could talk to? A lot Didn't he said, say Deadpool when he was a kid? Wait, Deadpool or my bugger? No, I'm saying like, didn't Wolverine save Deadpool when he was a kid or my bugger? No, no, no. I don't. No, I don't. I don't think he did. I don't think he. Did. I'm tweaking. I'm tweaking. So, who do y'all think he could be talked to when he say that? Then, when he say, "Trust me, kid. I'm no hero." X twenty three. Or Kid Pool, but but it could no, probably X twenty three, because look, probably X twenty three. That is more look, likely. That is more likely. I feel like this movie, like I don't know, bro, because she ran off by herself. So you think it could be in that same universe with with Logan? Yes, he could have been. Yeah, maybe. I mean, it looks like, like that is a possibility. Yeah, I feel like I I don't know, bro, because like kid though. He could have like, been talking to Deadpool. Though? I don't know. Kid Pool. Kid is kid. Kid. Mm. So do y'all y'all mm. know y'all know that the theory is going around also that there's going to be multiple Deadpools in here. Like as we seen Dog Pool, it's gonna be Lady Pool. I'm gonna explain that why we watched the first trailer after this one. It's gonna be Lady Pool. It's gonna be uh Kid Pool. Uh. I think it was four different dead and this Deadpool. We're gonna see Deadpool, we're gonna see Dog Pool, we're gonna see Lady Pool, and we're gonna see Kid Pool. And Baby Pool. I heard I we're gonna see five like different Spider-Man. Deadpools. I heard we was gonna cause we seen Dog Pool. I'm hearing that we're gonna hear yeah. we're gonna see five different Deadpools. And he might have either been talking to Kid Pool or X23. Kid is crazy though. For him to say kid is crazy, which I don't think she's gonna be a kid anymore. I think if she is do pop up, she's gonna be older. But I think, you know, if you a father and your it don't matter how old your kid get, he's still gonna call, you know, you still gonna call your child a kid. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So that could be a fact. You feel me? That could be a fact. You were an X-Man. You were the X-Man. That nigga is burly, bro. I am soaking wet right yeah. now. He was a big burly. <laughs> Oh, who so the hell was that? Did y'all see that? Right? The person on the stairs. Oh, the person on the stairs. That's Xavier X, evil sister. Like his, oh, proto- his prototype. Like they was they was born together, but uh he he uh sensed how evil she was and he tried to kill her. And I think he successfully killed yeah, her. Yeah, I remember back. that. Yeah, she grew, she grew a body back somehow. She grew a body back. And then uh, they say that she might be one of the, besides Thanos, she might be one of the second most craziest villains, even like over Hella, because they say like, like she's a real serious threat to the mutants. Uh, it, it was a lot, bro. We That's my kid. I'm no hero. But do y'all right. before we get there, make sure y'all pay attention to what's going on behind her when she steps out the steps. She have a wheelchair. And obviously we see her walking X-Man. to the steps. You were the X-Man. You think she got I Magneto? Soaking wet right now. She might got Magneto. She might have killed Magneto in her universe. Well, whichever universe that she in. If Bands is right, if Band Theories is right to where this might not be the void. 
but this might be an actual universe that just got destroyed by uh, Eliath. If Vans is right about that, then in this universe, this is where she might have killed, successfully killed Xavier X. Silly. Here, here we go, Ben. It's your time to shine, bro. Yep. Yeah, time bro. to shine, Ben. It's time to shine, Ben. Let us know. Let us know what's it's, going on. Right here is crazy because this got two, three. I kind of want to say three different ways. Three different ways is what this can be. One, this could be like the actual Ant Man, like our Ant Man, right? Right. That uh, passed out. You know, in his movie, like right. you said, that one day, or it could be the end game, Ant Man, or this could be the OG Ant Man. That's right. And they probably like either one of them got stuck in a quantum, main quantum, the quantum realm, yeah, or like they did some, you know, did something in the timeline they wasn't supposed to do, right? And you know, Elias probably came. You know, got him out of there. Sent them packing, which which is kind of crazy. Cause like, what? Why would? That's what threw me off the most with this trailer. Like, out of everything you see in here, why is an Ant Man suit right here? That's his. That's his whole body and flesh. That, well, that's not his flesh, but oh, that's his bones. Uh, yeah, his bones but yeah, his bones. Yeah, yeah like that's well, him. Yeah, like, why? Why? Is, oh, no. So that mean. He did something too that caused the incursion or something. Hell yeah! So what? What do you think is going on with the background? Like we see the clouds. You no, know I gotta bust the group. We see the clouds. We see the. We see the. Um. We see the cloud. We see the the sun in the back, and we see the sand. What do you think is going on in this image, though? Ah, I think Elias about to get busy. But but that's what I'm saying. Like, do, do y'all think this could be like a uh, uh, uh like what could this what could this be? Like we see the clouds. It and could the sun. be an alternate universe it where he just did universe. some shit. So if it's an alternate universe, that means Van's theory is right. If it's an alternate universe, because that means that right, it's a place. It could be. It the could boy, be an alternate universe. The boy doesn't look like this. That that's that's what I was about to say. But what if they void? What if they void look different? Different yeah. universe. It Man, could. Man, that could be. Cause the void is big as shit. It's not just it one like, area. It right. ain't like the void is like the TVA. The TVA is in its own time. Like it's a single time. Yeah, it's a, it's a the void can timeline. probably be. The void can probably be on multiple, other planets, multiple yeah. different universes. Yeah, cause he's part of a planet every time that he makes eats. Makes sense. It. That kind of makes so sense. So he really created so a whole planet in the void. That kind of that makes sense though, Ben. Cause look, right? Let me tell you why that makes sense. E. Loki play a big part in this movie. Like if you didn't watch Loki, bro, you kind of gonna be lost about a lot of stuff, right? Or if you if you don't know what's going on in Loki, like you're gonna be lost about a lot of stuff. Like you don't know about the void, like just the void, right? Like like E said, bro, the void is not just one. Like the void is like mad big, right? And Ben's mm -hmm. and Ben's perspective also, right? He say, right? Look, 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 y'all. He say. The void can it could be different voids in different universes, right? That could be a fact, right, y'all? Because let me tell you why. Because every time, every time, right, the, the void that we did see in Loki, right? We seen a yellow jacket head. Remember that? We seen the big yellow jacket head in the void. And then the grass was green. The sky wasn't super light and bright like this. And everything in there, it wasn't no mutants in there because. The mutants that's in this void, not even in our MCU. Right. Maybe this the is... The void that he was in was Loki's void. Loki's void. And everything that was going on in our universe. Because we did see Yellow Jacket. Yeah. We seen Yellow Jacket school. We seen the... Remember, we seen the frog. We seen the Thor frog under the ground. We seen yeah. all the other... Was it was it multiple? Yeah, we seen Kid Loki. There's we seen Loki Alligator still. Loki. We seen Alligator yep. Loki. We seen a lot. So that might have been yeah, our void for Loki, Max. That might have been our void for Loki. Dude, I'm itself. starting to think now. Cause look, right, I got something. I think I'm on to something, y'all. Right? 
that might, you might be right. That might have been a void. So look, right, we know this for sure, right? Loki, the reason why it's a lot of Lokis in the void and in, in, in our in Loki show, due to the simple fact because Loki was a threat to the multiverse. The TVA. Right? The, T the TVA and the multiverse. He got pruned because, remember the guy said, every Loki usually get prunes or go through something bad because they are a threat to the TVA and the multiverse. That's why we seen all the all of them went through something crazy in life that messed up the timeline, basically. Yeah. That's why you get pruned in the first place. Bro, what if there's another king, right, in this universe that pruned all mutants? Because obviously there's a lot of mutants in this universe, as we see. Yeah. What if this king, or whichever this void is, pruned mostly mutants here because, what did I say the first time, Bans? Every mutant might be a threat to a certain king. Yeah. That makes sense though. That hits. It kind of makes sense that because makes sense. Loki would have never got pruned in the first place if he wasn't a threat. If he wasn't only a threat to the people, timeline. Only people. They only they only prune niggas who are a threat that's like, to the timeline. That's like, like Deadpool. The, even though they got like the girl, because they was only looking for the girl for real, and that's why they gave him a pass. Because yeah. they wanted the girl Loki because she was the one who caused the whole shit. Right. Yeah, she was Loki. really the threat, but they also thought he was a threat too, though. But he was really on some like what? Because Loki went. He, he was a threat. He was a threat. He went against. He, he went against, he he went was, against his plan. Yep, yeah. Yep. Facts. 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 Yeah, he, like he anytime they go against their plan, and that's when they get pruned. Yep. And do something they're not supposed to do, or some go with the way it wasn't supposed to go. That's when they get pruned. So why is it mostly mm -hmm. mutants in this trailer right here? We get to, we see all a lot of mutants in this trailer. Why is they, all these mutant prunes? They did something to that get they prunes. wasn't but, supposed to do. But, well, well, hold on, but if they see how would she get pruned, pruned though? So you telling me Kane pruned her too though? He might have pruned her too. He might have pruned her too. Is she even though she is a threat? She, there's a threat to Kane too, because then she got she look crazy with it, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, he could have pruned her too for sure. I think he tried to prune everything that got something to do with mutants. Mutant yeah. anything. I think everything. And probably mutant had, anything. Fuck Lil, I was about to say Lil Wayne, but fuck Wolverine. <laughs> yeah. The like, silver surfer is gone. What? And um You talking about Fantastic Four? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, we got we got the girl uh Silver Surfer in that movie. That's crazy. All right, about to we about to finish this. Up. That was a good one. But well, look, all right, can y'all see this right here? Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All these people down here is mutants, bro. I've been getting a little snips going on. The dude with the in the red with the slick hair down the back that's closer to the steps with the red tail. He yeah. was in. Yeah. X, he was in X two. Ain't that Hellboy? No, no, that's not that's not Hellboy. It was it's uh, I forgot oh. he got a different name, but he was in X two. He was in a Wolverine movie at X two. Then you got Lady Deathstrike. Yeah. You got wait who? No, I think it ain't like something like Exel Exelia or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. If y'all in the comments, let us know down below, bro. What is dude name with the red with the slick hair? It started with an A. He was in X two, and then we see Lady Lady Deathstrike right here, right with the with the claws yeah. on the next side. Then you see the, the, the bald head dude next to her. Look behind oh, him. Oh, that's uh, that's dude from Doc Strange, ain't it? No, 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 no. That's not. That's not uh, Wong. That's not Wong. That's not Wong. That's not Wong. I look, thought it was. Look behind him, right? Behind him is Toad. Dude crouched down. Yeah. That is Toad right there from also the the previous X Men movies, and then the girl behind him is also a X Men mutant, and then the guy closer to the screen with the hair like super duper close over here. Y'all see him with the with the uh with the um he got the hat with the with the blind hair coming down kind of like Thor the chubby guy right he, here he he closer to the screen this is Sabretooth. that's crazy word word that's Sabretooth, gang this is crazy what? all mutants bro that's what I was saying before why is all mutants prune what why is there prune bro I think a cane prune all mutants because they are a threat to him being stopped. You know what I'm saying? And his plan to rule the multiverse. I think mutants is a is a is a heavy, you know, that's a heavy title, bro, mixed with the Avengers, bro. Bro. Crazy. You gotta really look at this picture, bro. 
That's this nigga's teeth. That's his teeth. That's his teeth. They have a entrance into this nigga's body, bro. Literally. I ain't gonna lie. I just wait. Hold on. I just had a crazy like I just been sitting here thinking, listen to y'all. I think I just had a crazy ass like theory. The <laughs> Some shit. What the fuck? Like. I ain't gonna lie, I think, I think what they doing, I think they, like, like, on some shit, I think they about to bring all some, I think they about to bring shit together. Because I ain't gonna lie, this mm, take, that's after, a good theory. like, I feel like they bringing, like, right, Sabretooth, all of them, right? Yeah. I think they about to bring all, I think they about to combine them together. Like... Cause as we seen in this, we see all of them right here. As, as we, right, and we know I'm thinking this. they about to combine all of them together as one, like on some end game. But it ain't it, so. It, it's taking like it's like a, some futuristic shit. Cause it's cause they bringing them, they bringing these niggas. Bro, this is what we finna. They bringing these niggas to Deadpool. And Wolverine with Marvel, you get yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. That's, that's what's crazy. Yeah. So I feel like they, I feel like they, what they doing? <laughs> they about to combine two world, like two, two multi universes, multiverse. Yeah. yeah, they about to combine both of them together as one. Because be as we see, as we see, he's dead. And man, he dead. dead. Yeah. You see in the statue, right? So it take place after. So it's another multiverse that's him, that he's dead right now. He dead. Right. But in the other multiverse, he alive. That'd so what is, what's missing? What's missing in between them two? Cause not because look, he 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 alive in the other one as we Yeah, he alive. That's what I'm saying. Kinda, so why, 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 yeah, why is why in this multiverse? As like, you see it right now, he dead. Like because he didn't if, know about the vo he didn't know about this nigga. He probably found about he probably found out about this nigga, or did did something like he wasn't supposed to do or, that the other nigga did. Or what if it's no Avengers in the universe? Man, it was just an Ant Man. Ah, but it, I mean, there's an alternate it universe. Be, it could have just been him. No, nah, it gotta be, bro. But it got, it, yeah, and I, I feel that though. It probably gotta be more than just Ant Man. I feel what you're saying, though, Jerry. Yeah, because like, that's be what more. I'm saying. Like, I mean, they could have, they could have died, like just like Ant Man. Yeah, died. that's what I'm saying. I'm saying like, how in this multiverse, we? So that's what I'm saying. Are we going to see more people that's dead, like him, in the other multiverse? Probably. You get what I'm saying? That's what's crazy, yeah. though. I see what you're saying, though, Jerk. But it's that's like, what I was saying is, earlier. How was it only? How is we? This is what y'all know. Y'all know it's gonna be iconic. Though. I'm gonna let y'all know this now, bro. If this happened, if in the future, the near future, bro, they get to meet an Ant Man and they tell him like, bro, we used to live in your body, bro. That'd be fucking right. Crazy. That'd be insane. Wait, dude, look. Like, that's what I'm saying. They, they look at him as like this nigga's a god, bro. Like, what did they look at him like? What did this kind of like a trophy to them? Like, you see what I'm saying? Like. This is like, you know what I'm saying? That's like going back. Bro, you really gotta realize how crib, far bro. back this shit really been going, though, gang. Look at the car. No, that's what I'm. That's why I say it's probably pruned because we know that this. They've been doing suit this is, for years. But no, look, look, look. That's why I say it. That's why it's kind of hard to really say what's going on because bands say this is a universe, and I say it's probably pruned, right? Due to the simple fact, if you check the other side, right behind Sabretooth, bro, that's that's the that's the flying bathtub. Do y'all know the flying bathtub come from Fantastic Four? Yeah, I was about to say that. Yeah. Look behind Sabretooth, right? Y'all see we're told crouching yeah. down there, right? Then the girl right there with the ponytail, then right behind yeah. her, that's the flying bathtub. So they got Fantastic Four cars, and they got Red School. That car that you talking about, right? With the car that dude is sitting on, and he also from you know a X Men movie. You talking about the car that he's sitting on with the wheels? That's also yeah. that's Red Skull car, bro. The 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 villain from Iron Man movie, Red Skull. That's his car. Damn. That's his car. See that? See nah, yeah, okay, the nah, Fantastic wait. Fantastic Four cars over there. Then we got an Ant Man. This suit is new. This is a really y'all think about yeah, it. Yeah, right? it is a new time, suit. 
The first time we see this suit was in a newer Ant-Man movie. Then think about it. Like I was telling bands before when I was streaming the other time, bro, Ant-Man didn't really get to go big, like giant like this until what? Endgame for real. But yeah. never really before that oh, we seen uh, him go big. Not Endgame. What's, that? What's the, uh, the no, war? Was... The war? I think yeah. that's oh, yeah. Silver no, it War. It happened that's in Wanda good... too. Yeah. Silver... It happened in that's Wanda right. too. That, I think that's Civil it War. It happened in Wanda too when they no, were zombies war. and shit. That's Civil remember, War. That's Civil like, War. That's Civil uh, War. When Wanda was, uh, yeah, she, she yeah. fought around and injured, uh, Rhodey. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. And Vision, they always fight. Yeah, that's, that's, what, what, that, that's, that's what that was. That's what that was. Like yeah. Panther on them. They that's, oh, that's, yeah, that's, that's, that's the, Civil War. Yeah. That's Civil War. That's when, that's when the first, like, he got, he went big in his own movie, but he passed out. But he got really mm -hmm. good, in, like Jer said, in Civil War. I did not think about that, bro. That's why you be needing people to, to, you know what I'm saying? Get you right, gang. Like, I forgot, I man. He, he didn't get big in Civil War. Huh? Didn't he die in Civil War? No, he didn't die. No, no, no. He didn't die. He was he still alive to the uh, to the end. Game. He died. He didn't. No, That's he why I'm saying he can die. Nah, he How y'all get what I'm saying? Why in All this multiverse? All they did to Ant Man was triple, bro. That's really it, bro. All they did was triple. Nah, he, he didn't die in Civil War. He didn't die. He didn't die. He didn't die. But in this multiverse, he did. He didn't That's die in Civil That's what's like due to the Civil War. I feel like they got a they got a story with this, bro. Cause ain't no way. I feel like. I I think I ain't gonna lie, like you said, like red school, red score and all them, bro. The idea it's a combine, bro. Cause look, think wait, about it. Wait, right? wait, what? So that's not red school right there? No, no, no that's no, not red. No, school. no, no, no. Nah, that's. Do you see the dude, so the dude with the red tail? He was in X two. I forgot his name. He was in X two. Yes. Yeah, so uh, so remember, remember, remember Doctor Strange, bro? And uh, remember the scene with Wanda? Not not the regular Wanda, the other Wanda. Yeah. The one that was, yeah. The one and that he, killed. And he had the Fantastic Four in yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, the one that killed, right? that stretched. That's, that, what yeah. I'm, that's, that's what I'm saying. That, that's they combined. Also combined yeah, they also combined and shit. Like, think that. about <laughs> it. Like, really think about it, bro. <laughs> the they movies, they, they, they put, trying to combine. I see what you're saying. Like, they trying to they combine everybody. They literally put the Fantastic Four, the, the stretchy nigga. They put him in there, bro, and he died. Yeah, yeah. Like you get what I'm saying? So they, the, it's up, bro. It's it's another multiverse that we don't know about because they, it gotta be, bro. It gotta be, bro. Because yeah, they keep. Because if you really think about the like back then and now, bro, they combined in, bro. Yeah, they is. They is. No cap. They, they, they put in the Fantastic Four, Marvel, X Men. And, and, you get and, what I'm saying? Black it's ball in them too. Black ball in them too. Right, Black it's Ball something, too. bro. It's something, bro. It's and that's what makes you think it's like bro. a different, you know, multiverse because how the fuck, like, not saying it ain't possible, but how the fuck they gonna prune Ant Man big ass when he like this? Prune sticks yeah. like that. He, they ain't I'm that, not gonna I mean, lie, bro. That, that's kind of a fact. That prune work on anything. It do, they didn't, as soon as it touches I mean, you, it evaporate. Do. As soon as it touches you, you evaporate. As soon as it touches you, you evaporate. It don't matter your size. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Bro. And Loki season two, did they not have a gun that you can shoot and it prove you? Remember? Yeah. Did they have a gun? Yeah. It yeah, was it did. was in the um that was when they was that's when they found out that them niggas them niggas was fake and they was shooting guns at them. Remember, remember right, bands, bro. Y'all remember this, right? In Loki season two, bro. Remember <laughs> when they when remember when the dude turned to the good came? Remember he went in that remember they went in that room and she was like, prove me. Did they have like a big crazy looking gun? That prune people wasn't it like a gun that he had? Damn, Wait. I'm trying to think. Remember they was Wait. in that little room, right? Remember and Miss Minute started going crazy. Remember Miss Minute started going crazy, right? Miss Minute started going berserk. And then remember, she started trying to like push up on the good king to make him think, oh, this is that. Remember oh. that little room? And remember he closed yeah. oh, it. Remember he yeah. closed it up. And remember, he yeah. had like a big, crazy looking gun that pruned people. I think that's what he yeah. was in or something like that or something he was working on. Because remember, I think uh, Miss Minutes like, oh, this was you was working on. And he was like, yeah, that's still a prototype. Remember, it was something like that. It was yeah, something. and she grabbed it and pruned something, I think. Yeah, I or think, he shut her off right before she did. Yeah, he shut her off. And then remember, uh, Sylvie, the other girl, Loki, walked in the room. Remember, she walked in through the portal. And remember, yep. I think they had about to have a prune battle or something like that. It was something. It was something, bro. I can't remember. It was something, bro. But I think they got guns. But any point of view is right, though. If the prune stick even touch you, right, 
you're automatically getting pruned no matter what your size is because as we can see in the void from loki they done pruned bolts yeah bolts is being pruned bridges the whole bridge from from um that the, is true. the that bridge is true. from magneto that he to destroy it was pruned. Like multiple big stuff was pruned. Remember the big head of Yellow Jacket was pruned. Yep. So this is the two takes that I had. This was my theory about how Ant Man could be this big and he's in the void or if he's in the universe. <laughs> Only two ways Ant Man could get pruned while he this big, right? Boom. He went out fighting, right? Against a lot of TVA members and he tried to end big it. Because as we can see, when he get bigger and big it, he still can get hit. As we just heard from Jared in Civil War, he got big in Civil War while he was fighting them. And he almost, he thought he died. He didn't die, but they did trip him. Remember, he can still get touched. You yeah. know what I'm saying? He can still physically get touched. And don't get think about it like he's slower. Once the bigger he get, the slower he get. Yeah. Right? Boom. And not only that, or he was just probably, um, how else could he get in the void? Right? Dead like this. Maybe he was, maybe he got pruned and he went this big fighting Goliath. Maybe wait, Goliath wait, 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 wait. Those are my two things. Hold on, just say this. Hold on. Maybe he fought the TVA and then they pruned him in the mid fight, or he got pruned. Then he went big trying to fight Goliath and died. Those are my two theories. Go ahead, Jerry. Those are my two theories. Why he, how he could be this big Bro. in the void or the universe? Wait, what? What did? What did he say when he was talking to uh, Captain America? Uh, and, um, old girl. In game. What was he in? What was he in? That was the that's what Bans was saying. He was in the quantum realm. That was the quantum realm. That's where he went. He went to the quantum realm. After Civil War, then that's when the Ant Man movie came out and he went into into the quantum realm. And then he came out the quantum realm in Endgame. He said it felt like five minutes in there to me, but it was five years for y'all. That's where he went. Damn. That was Damn. the quantum realm he went to. So what about the the shit with Kane though? Where was Kane at? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Kane, where was he at? Kane was at the end of time where he was at. He was at the end of time, like watching over the timelines. But the and boy, the Kane in Ant Man was in the crime world. Yeah, the the Kane that was in Ant Man. Not you talking about the one in Loki or Ant Man? The one in Loki, he was at not the, end the one of time. in. Oh, okay. The one in okay. Ant Man movie, they was all in the quantum realm. Yeah, okay, okay. We I'm like, shit getting look real. Get real what about big slow motion action sequence? Oh. Who knows if you live or die? Her powers is crazy. Let's just say that, right? Her powers is Not crazy. even going to cap. Her powers is She crazy. definitely is motherfucking Ermac. No cap. <laughs> I just did she did. Oh gosh, he hit that nigga with that Ermac. Her powers is crazy, man. She she, Wait, she made that nigga dance. Uh, literally. In game? Huh? She made that nigga that's dance. Old, no, no that's, that's a nigga sister, sister gang. No, no, that's she oh. knew. That's that's Exa Charles Xavier, Xavier X twin sister. But he yep. when they was babies, he killed her in the womb because he sensed how evil evil she was. But, what the fuck? Yeah, yeah. So now she she's a threat to the multiverse. Her goal is to kill all mutants and like to kill all the mutants. That's her goal. Kill all the mutants. That's like her goal to make sure that all the mutants are dead and they're all gone. They say like this. A lot of people yeah. said like that was trending and that was uh that was theories that she gonna be the the second most craziest villain, bro. Like they say like she ain't no joke. Like she bound. As you can see, she literally just put his his own claws through his own legs and just made him dance like they say like she got the okay. power literally yeah like like when you think of wanda and jean gray you gotta think of her type shit like like they say like she from the comics type shit like she od that's sure. mm. let's fucking go let's fucking go let's talk about it let's talk about it Let's talk about it, y'all. Let's talk about it. Let's hey, I think that it. I think that's the I think that's what's the name? That the uh okay. nigga, bro, they, they be no nah, who be with who who's the nigga that be with uh right. Doctor Strange? Bro. Okay, Wong, right? Wong. Oh, right, bro, bro. I everybody, think it's him, bro. Everybody, no give, a, everybody give an answer on who this is this before we talk about what's going on, where they jumping to, right? Let's go on the first thing. 
who do y'all think could be opening this portal? It's long, for sure. Probably, I ain't gonna lie. Jersey who the only be people real that's going up for me to say this? I feel like it's Doggy Bone from the Spider Man movie, no cap. That could be a fact, bro. The nigga with fact. the glasses. No fake. Oh! That could be a fact. That could be a fact. Who you think? Nah. That could be a fact, though. He was definitely opening portals to different he dimensions. Definitely did. He was. He was, though. I mean, he he was, though. Who you think it is, Bears? Sheesh. I ain't gonna lie. For me, it gotta be either Wong or Doctor Strange. Because. Cause I, I ain't gonna lie, I'm sticking to my theory, bro. I think this is a different universe, bro. That's what I, I think this is a different, different universe, and Doctor Strange can do that, bro. That might he, be like I know Doctor Strange can do that, bro. Look, Doctor Strange can walk that and do that, up. like you said, trans, bro. That nigga can't do that to the void. That's what I, y'all gotta think about that too. Like I don't think. Wait, hold on. Let me let me let me pinpoint this. Loki can do that. No, 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 no. Name him boy to this. We are we about to get on that too though about the Loki stuff too, cause that's what uh that's what Eve was talking about. We about to, I'm about to explain that for you, gang. Look, this is why Bans is saying that, right, y'all? Y'all gotta think about how strong of a sorcerer you have to be to get to the void, bro. If it is that's a why. void, if it's not, not even the sinister, not even the fucking the one Doctor Strange we seen, the uh one that beat that on some shit. Yeah, yeah, not even he him could do that. He that's he, why, I don't even think he could do that. That's why it'll no, be hard he, if it was. He tried, but they locked him up because he was doing too much. Yeah. Are you talking about like with the dark hole? Yeah, because he, yeah, yeah. he was trying to do it, but they wasn't allowing him to do yeah. it. He was like, you, You're not going to do that. Yeah, trying to fuck everything. Shit, so they had to kill that nigga. So, boom. This is why it's hard for me to say it's Wong, though, Jer, because, bro, you got to think about how powerful you have to be. To make a, a slingshot portal to the void. If this is the void, if it's just a universe, another universe, it's possible. That's what I'm saying, Vance. It's possible that it could just be re our regular Doctor Strange or our regular Wong. If it's just another universe. That's still OD2, though. But you gotta think about it. We never really seen nobody make a portal. That's why E is kind of right, but it's like, I, it's kind of like hard because look, right? I'm about to try to explain it, right, y'all? We never seen yeah. nobody make a portal to a different universe except Spider Man best friend. No, that's Doc the only Doctor Strange did that too multiple times in his movie. Oh, yeah, yes, he did. in his movie. Oh, you right. His movie. Oh, his mo oh, yeah, 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 right. right. Dermamo is that. in a yeah, Dermamo is in his own universe. Yep. I feel like Wong going to fight Dormammu is a is a far fetch too as the void. I think that's a far fetch too, Ben. I'm not gonna lie. So that's it could that's be that's the regular Doctor Strange or the regular one, or like he said, it could be Spider Man best friend. So what 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 Ian said that it could be anybody that know how to do this is what he said. It could be anybody. Yeah. 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 Cause but I don't, the, don't know about Wong though. No. I ain't never seen Wong. No, Wong do that. can do okay, it. Wong that can point, do it. Wong can do it. No, you Wong that point it do makes sense because, because he did do it. He did, he did, he did it in game. He did, game. I'm he did it in game and he did it in Spider Man No Way Home where he walked out the portal. Y'all remember when we watched y'all remember yep. Spider Man No Way Home? Remember? And Wong was like, Don't go too crazy or making everybody forget who Spider Man is. Remember he made a portal and he walked to yeah. the movie Shang Chi. Cause remember Shang Chi was fighting the um remember Shang Chi was fighting the green dude and Shang was in I mean uh Wong was in Shang Chi. But even though Shang Chi is still in the same universe as us, but he, you know, he he could do the portal too real good. But I feel like if he well, how he said if Wong, not Wong, but if Spider Man best friend can make a portal. The dude, the, the boy of Spider-Man, my Spider-Man best friend, his guy in a chair. If he can make a portal to open up a different universe for two Spider-Mans, why couldn't Doctor Strange or Wong do it? Or why couldn't it just be him doing it? That's what I'm saying. But see, to mm -hmm. not, not, not that y'all saying that, but why would he make a portal? Though? What would he be making a portal for them, though? <sighs> But how, Why we know, be doing that? how do we know it's for them though? How we don't know it, it could it because you gotta think about it. I'm thinking that this portal right here is might be towards the end of the movie to where like okay, this is what's going on. Like maybe this portal right here could be the jump for the next movie to come out and let us know what's going on. So why it, why do it have to be like just for Dr. Strange and Wong? Like how do you know it ain't just for him? Like, oh, we need these two. How 
it could be how we needed the two Spider-Mans to, to kill Green Goblin and everybody else. You feel me? My thing is, though. Mm -hmm. But you movie. gotta think about it though. He only opened the portal because he was trying to get his Spider Man, like his Peter Parker. He nice. didn't think he didn't think them two was gonna pop up out the portal. That's facts. He look he was looking for his Spider Man, and them two came out the portal. Right? Boom. What if? Right? This is what it, this to E. This to E statement. He said that it could be. I'm trying to defend E statement on why he's saying it could be Ned. That's his name, Ned yeah. from Spider Man. Yeah. What if? Right, this is a what if. This is a what if. What if he's older now and he practiced with Kamataj and it's something bigger going on? Maybe like the event of Secret Wars and he like, okay, we need these two guys and he got stronger or better with it. Like, I can see that. I can see that. Because let's not forget, Doctor okay. Strange know who Ned is. He's been in his house. He know that he's opened up a portal because remember he came out the portal. He remember he told Ned like. Remember, he, remember what did he tell Ned when he came out the portal? He was like, did you do that? Remember when they all was fighting? He was like, did you open up that portal? Because oh, yeah, look, right? Because look, right? I'm about, to, I'm about to blow your minds with this, right? Remember, E? Because I'm defending E's statement. Remember when they all was fighting the lizard people on top of the tower, right? Yeah. And remember Ned, right? He had the slingshot on his two fingers. Remember, he was opening up portals. He the reason Doctor Strange mm -hmm. came out the portal in the first place from hanging upside down after... After Spider Man kept him hanging upside the Grand Canyon for so long, Ned was the one that got him out. Spider Man yeah. never had the slingshot. MJ never had the slingshot. None of the Spider Man had the slingshot. And none of the villains had the slingshot. And Doctor Strange didn't have his slingshot. Only how he got back from the Grand Canyon was from Ned opening portals. Remember, he opened up two. He opened one from the school when they started running with the box. And he opened one from hanging upside the Grand Canyon. So Doctor Strange knows that Ned is powerful enough to open up portals. Not only through the Grand Canyon, but to the multiverse. That's defending E's statement. What if he's older? We don't know what what like what time place do this movie take time in, like on the other side of this portal. We don't know which universe this is in. <coughs> that so it could be Ned. We don't know which unit, what timeline or universe is behind this portal that they jump into. We don't exactly know who's opening. This is hey, my thing, though. Yeah, wait, oh, wait. You you peep that like you kind of see that like is somebody standing right there in the back. Yeah, yeah, in the back. That's that's her. That's that's yeah. his sister. That's her in the back with the coat. Well, why is she standing right like there, right like that? Like she might be trying to follow them, yeah. or she might be okay with where they're going because it might be something dangerous. Or I don't know, but. If this is the boy, if this is the boy, who would be strong enough? I'm going to give y'all who I think it is, right? I'm going to give y'all who I think it is. Who would be, like, like Banza said, right? Who would be strong enough? If this is the boy, because obviously we see a life, we've never seen a life outside the void. We've never seen him outside the void. So if it is the void, then obviously the void have a lot of different, obviously we've seen in Loki that the void have a lot of different things that's pruned in it. So by me seeing the Fantastic Four car, a uh, Red School car, all these different mutants, a uh, Ant Man, this is everything that got in here that's from separate universes. So for all of it to be in a void, if it is the void, it's like who would be strong enough to make a portal to the void at the end of time? It could be our Doctor oh. Strange. It could be our Doctor Strange because now he had the third eye. So oh, now he got, he, got the third third eye. he got the third eye. He got the third eye, y'all. Doctor Strange now have the third eye because at the end of Multiverse of Madness, Clea, who is also another strong sorcerer, met up with him and they walked through a portal and she told him that the world is at stake and we need, you know, the encouragement is about to happen. And that's when he got his third eye. So maybe he is the Sorcerer Supreme now and he can open up portals to the end of time. That's one person I think it could be. Two, I think it could be America Chavez, y'all. I think it could be America Chavez, bro. I think she's strong enough to make a portal at the end of time, bro. Because y'all already, already jumping to different universes, already, So, I, so hey, I don't know if you do. Y'all remember who America Chavez was? She was the little girl in Multiverse of Madness. Where, remember, uh, Jerry, when Wanda killed the Fantastic Four? Remember the girl she was trying to capture? Yeah. Her, the little girl that she was trying to take her powers from. The little girl that she was trying to kill. Her. 
That's America mm-hmm. Chavez. And at the end of and at the end of Multiverse of Madness, America Chavez was learning how to do sorcerer, and she already strong enough to easily without not, like that's her power to jump through multiverses. So why not learn how to use Kamatage and learn how to go to different places? And she already strong enough to just go willingly. Like this ain't something that like it's a mistake. Like her powers is to make a star portal and she could jump to any universe. Whether it's the Fantastic Four universe, whether it's any universe in the world, whether it's the comic books, bro. Because as we seen her going through with Doctor Strange, they went to a comic book and a Lego universe. She has that power to visit the Lego universe. You know what I'm saying? So I think it's either Doctor Strange with the third eye, Sorcerer Supreme, Doctor Strange, America Chavez. My last one is the Asian one, y'all. I'm not going to lie. I think... This universe, uh, the ancient one, might have not died. And the Asian one, y'all, that's the bald lady that, that taught Dr. Yeah. Strange how to use his powers. Yeah. It's, I think it's out of them three. Let's finish this trailer, bro. We done got some good points, though. We done got some good points. Yeah! Wanna do some cocaine? Hey! Cocaine is the one thing that Feige said is off limits. What about Bolivian marching powder? They know all the slang terms. They have a list. Even snowboarding? Even disco dust. White girl interrupted? Even forest bump. Do you want to build a snowman? Yes! But I can't. Damn, <coughs> y'all. Happy birthday Happy to Now it's the first trailer. It's the first trailer. Last one. Okay. All right, okay. Um, it's been a challenging few years, for sure. But I'm happy. That is because of each and every one of you. I am the luckiest man alive. <laughs> Make a wish, buddy. This is crazy. Wait, Wilson? Who's asking? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, that's a different TVA too. No, no, it's hundred percent. Yeah, that's a that's a different TVA than what we already seen in Loki too. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that supposed to be scary? Pegging isn't new for me, friendo, but it is for Disney. Now this movie about to be crazy, bro. When you watch the when you when you watch the first yeah. and the second trailer together, bro, you get to see different like points of the movie. Like this one, he getting captured by the TVA. He talking about hey, well, it is for Disney. It's all so spooked out and quiet and dramatic. And the other one just action packed, like it's crazy. <sighs> Mr. Wilson. You appear to have soiled yourself. Like in this one, y'all, he's so confused about everything. Who are you? In the other one, he's so prepared about everything. Walk with me. Wait. You are special. This is your chance to be a hero among heroes. That is crazy, bro. I smell what you're stepping in, Sensei. Yes, that the is. They definitely feel like some shit. It's about to change forever. Y'all, you know I me mean? tell a theory. Somebody said that that he was set up to be the one to stop Iron Man from dying in the alternate universe. And him saying "I am Marvel Jesus" is the quote to "I am Iron Man." Oh, I I'm the Messiah. Here you go. Am. I think that was a lesson, y'all. I think he was practicing on how to snap his fingers and say, I am Deadpool or I am Marvel Jesus at the end game fight, bro. I think he's going to be jumping through different different universes, bro, and iconic universes. Like, I mean, iconic moments that happen throughout the MCU. And I think we're getting Iron Man back, bro. I think they're going to bring, like Jer said, I think they're going to combine everybody together in the alternate universe. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And I think that's why he looked like that, y'all. I think he was confused. I think he was confused on how he said it. Like, uh, okay, I think that'll work. That'll, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Let me pull right here, E. Let me pull right here. Yeah, the double oh Uzi. 
Double Uzis. Double Uzis. Deadpool never uses double Uzis. Deadpool never uses double Uzis, man. Yeah. So we but we gonna see also another Deadpool. I think it's Lady Pool, bro, with double Uzis, bro. That's R. That's insane, bro. What if we see the Wolverine X23 and Deadpool and Lady Pool all fighting together, bro? That is gonna rock theater, bro. As we see the double Uzis, we know that this is a different Deadpool. So that's gonna rock. God, I love this part. Wait! <sighs> Don't just stand there, you ape. Give me a hand up. Nope, I'm actually okay. Thank you very much. Oh my God, GG. GG, y'all. I don't know, bro. It's going to be crazy, bro. I think this is about to be setting up the big movie, bro. Secret Wars, bro. I think the ending of this, maybe the post credit scene, bro, is going to show us a lot, bro, about what's going on in the next event of Secret Wars. I still think it's going to be a fight in between which universe stay alive and which universe, which, un which universe dies. And I think our Earth 616 is going to die. Because I got a theory here with somebody saying, let me read the theory off to y'all, man, so y'all can see. Somebody had a great theory, bro. I, I said it to you earlier, Baz. Um, Somebody said, Marvel Studios' plan for Avengers Secret Wars is for Earth-616 to be destroyed after Secret Wars and a new universe will be the main base of the MCU. And they say, as for the remaining heroes, all of them will not die and they will find a way to bring all of them to a new universe. All of them, all the X Men, Black Boy, all the Fantastic Four, Miles Morales, Wolverine, and we gonna get our Iron Man back also through an alternate universe. I think uh, Deadpool will save Iron Man because I think Iron Man is also one of the structure. Um, what is it called? Like one of the the, the spines, like oh, Wolverine. Anchor. Yeah, I think he's like an anchor of. The MCU and I think we kind of need him to balance out how the world evolves around the heroes so I think Wolverine is going to save the MCU bro literally and I think that's why he calls himself the Marvel Jesus bro I would not be surprised if he go back and save Quicksilver bro I would not be surprised bro in the Ultron battle I would not be surprised yeah, I was about to say because he died in a fucked up way he did like, bro he did too fast I bro. get it hot though like Wow. And I think Deadpool is going to be saving the universe, bro.